Hey guys, we're back with another episode of How to Play Mind Test. We are on the exact same world, just barely finished recording the other one. We're going to go downstairs and work on uh, our chest room while it's nighttime, because that's something that you can do at night, which is recommended. Alright, so we're going to build a ridiculous amount of chests here. Um, 64, and it takes 8, so that's going to give us 8 chests. That's a pretty good start. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... And I'm sure there's a faster way to do this, but you know... There you are. Now if you center click, it'll build them all. Can at least speed that part up. Alright, so... We're going to do the old above-below approach there. And we've got that right there. So we probably want to... I can either dig this out so that they're inside, which is kind of a neat idea, actually. Hmm. Tempting. Let's do that. Why not? Oh, and look at that. We just happened to find some iron ore right there. Of course, it's going to have another one right behind it. This is why you always keep a little bit of dirt on you people just in case. Anybody else? Anyone else wants to play? Alright, looks like that was it. Alright, let's go ahead and slap some of this back in there. Because I don't like leaving things out in the open like that. Um, we could probably go ahead and build some uh, ovens down here too so that we can Get that going as well. I'm liking that setup. The only problem is, in order to put signs underneath, so you can say, this is this chest, this is that chest, um, you can't have the torches in the way. So we're going to have to do it up like that. Which, again, is not a big deal, but it is something we have to consider. I think we'll go ahead and set it up like that. Just get everybody up right now. That way, as we add stuff, we don't end up running into anything. All right, so let's go ahead and hollow this out. We can make four more chests for this side. And then this side over here, I think we will do as our ovens. Four. One, two, three, four. Yep. Which means that torch is going to have to move. As predicted. Alright. So now, let's build us a whole bunch of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I'm sure someone is screaming somewhere saying, Why are you doing it that way? It's awful. Because I like to be precise, and I don't know a better way to do it. Center click. I can at least speed that part up. Alright. Why anyone would need this many furnaces, I don't know. I mean, unless you're baking a ton of stuff, and I mean a ton of stuff. It's beyond me. Alright, so we need four more chests here. Hopefully we end up with enough. 16, that's only going to get two chests. Alright, we're going to have to take a trip upstairs, guys. Ka-ching, ka-ching. Alright. Head on up here. I'm pretty sure we've got more. Yeah, we've got, well, we've got the pine tree blocks. I assume that'll do the same thing. Just in case, let's just go out. We'll hit the hay. Thank you. Alright, let's go chop down some trees. I was hoping not to do that, but we're kind of at that point. So, we got to.
forgot that part. Well, we'll leave him there then, I guess, for now. Really, I should just move that source block over one. That would be the smart thing to do. I think it's just if we harvest one row of trees, that should be plenty. To finish off what we're doing. And because these other trees are too close... Alright, we got any saplings out of that? Not really. Well, we've got saplings in the chest inside. We just needed to uh, get some wood for downstairs, our little activity we're working on. Ka ching And hopefully this is enough to actually finish everything out, because we also need to put signs in the middle. Maybe I'll just do one sign if I run out of stuff. Oh, that's plenty. All right, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Again, someone's screaming somewhere. Okay, let's go ahead and put those in. Now, let's make a bunch of signs. It's at least something. One, two, three, four, five. And six, that's what we got. And grab a handful of those, because I'm going to need to build an X here in a minute. In fact, let's do that now. Nothing worse than having to go back to a wooden pickaxe. It's pretty awful. All right. So... I almost even got all the signs up. How sad is that? So the way you do this is you say, up. And then say what it is. So we'll go plants. Comma, down. Yeah, I actually kind of like that. It's easier to find it. Down. Um, wood. Those kind of go together. So now you look at this. Oh, so I've got my plant stuff up there and different kinds of wood down there. And so this one we might go up um, or ors down uh, stone, I guess. So we could you know put our cobblestone and our slabs in here. Those would all make sense in this one, where up is ore, so we'd put like our iron lumps up there. That would make sense. Uh, this one was plants, so we could put leaves. We could put our apples in there. Our wheat can go in there. That would make sense in there. And then the bottom was wood, and I've already used all my wood, so I'll go and put that in there. Oh, coal is also technically one of those, but seeing as we're going to be cooking stuff over here, it'd probably be better to put coal over there. Anyway, that's just to give you an idea. Um, so this one we could go up, tools, down, um, what do you think, like uh, fence posts and ladders? Or would those still be tools? Yeah, we don't know what we're doing in down yet. That's fine. So, we can put our shovel up here. Our axe. Shovel. Hoe. Cotton, yeah. Maybe we'll save building materials for the bottom. 
uh, or craft materials. That will work. Crafting. So there we are. So tools and crafting. So down here we can put our cotton, which we could then craft into a bed or something. So there you go. That's a pretty decent chest room. So you'll come down, you have lots of chests, lots of ovens, so you can be smelting stuff all the time. And it's nice and organized, so you can get in, get to everything. Um, if you were a little more cramped for space, you could do some chests on the ceiling and on the floor, but you wouldn't have anything in the middle to put signs on. But that would be one way to uh, make this a little bit more dense than it is right now. And I could even go one more this direction if I wanted to and still have plenty of room. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, just a little organization uh, episode, getting our chest room set up. And we will catch you guys next time. Until then, go build something.